Hello kids, you remember yesterday we did the story of elephant, elephant artist, isn't it? So what was it about? The elephant making paintings and I, as I told you, there are so many elephants that make paintings and they are intelligent animals, isn't it? Elephants are intelligent animals. They can remember everything for a long time and they can make paintings too. So, here in the lesson, there are so many words that are having meanings. So, what you have to do is, you have to write the meanings of the word in the notebook. Uh, and those words are given in bold letters. See, brisky, scratching and auction. So, what is brisky? Brisky is doing anything quickly and scratching is like scratching making a mark when we do a painting we first mark right we make a mark and then we do the painting and after that we have here is auction what is auction to put something on a sale like uh, if we if we have to uh, if you do any painting or if you do any kind of work that can be put on sale like making a teddy bear or making a jewelry. So what we can do is we can put it on an auction, right? Fine. Now, now we are going to, I am going to explain the questions and answers of this lesson. Now I am going to explain the exercises and question answers of this lesson this is what we are going to do today fine okay now here what it is what it is ruby was an asian gorilla that lived in the phoenix zoo what was ruby ruby was a uh, was we here it is true and false right we have to write true or false for the sentences given write t for true and f for false ruby was an asian gorilla that lived at phoenix zoo what who was ruby ruby was a gorilla no right so it is false who was ruby ruby was an Elephant, artist elephant, isn't it? Ruby was born in Thailand. See, we have studied in the lesson. Ruby was born in Thailand, isn't it? So, this is true. Yes, Ruby was born in Thailand. One day, her keeper saw her painting in the dirt with a brush. Did What did the keeper see? Did the keeper saw her painting? No, this is false. The keeper saw her scratching the dirt with a stick, right? So, this is also false. At the age of 50, she died from an infection. When did Ruby die? Did Ruby die at the age of 50? No, Ruby died at the age of 25, right? So, this is also false. False. Two elephants from India were also given the opportunity to become artists. This is true or false? Yes, this is true. See, it is written here in the... Written here, isn't it? See, it is written in the passage also. Two elephants from India were also given the opportunity, isn't it? So... This is true. Yes, two elephants from India were given the opportunity. Fine? Okay. Now question and answer. Where did Ruby live for most of her life? Where was Ruby living? Where did Ruby live for most of her life? Ruby lived in, a, in the Phoenix Zoo. That was in US, United States. Isn't it? And... Where was she born? She was born in Thailand. But 
she she was brought to the phoenix zoo in us how old was ruby when she came to america see how old was ruby when she came to america ruby was only 7 months isn't it it is written in the passage see she was about 7 months old right so the answer we have to write is ruby was only 7 months old how did the zoo staff get idea of giving ruby paints and brush why because one day the ruby's keeper saw her briskly scratching the dirt see it's written over here one day her keeper saw her briskly scratching the dirt with a stick so they gave her a paint brush and some paint from here they got the idea that if we train her they she can do nice painting fine okay now number 4 how did ruby die how did ruby die ruby died from an infection when she was 25 years old see it's written here ruby died from an infection when she was 25 year old right even animals bhi bimar padte hai na unko bhi infection lagta hai like see now we are getting infected with corona virus isn't it corona virus se hame infection lagta hai to if we don't take care of ourselves we will be also in falling into the danger and we will be jeopardizing our, our lives we can fall into the danger aur hame bhi infection lag sakta hai agar hum dhyan nahi rakhe right so similarly ruby also died of some infection but it was a brilliant intelligent blessed animal that can do painting right okay so now this were the questions from the textbook now my questions that is in the form of fill in the blanks you have to fill in the blanks this is your homework for today elephants are dashed with talent of paintings tell tell what are the elephants see elephants are gifted with the talent of painting isn't it so what will be coming here gifted elephants are gifted with talent of paintings okay she was the only dash at the zoo what was she she was see she was the only elephant at the zoo fine she was the only elephant at the zoo soon a trainer started training what soon a trainer started training ruby isn't it soon a trainer started training ruby then one of her dash was sold for $25000 what was sold for $25000 one of her paintings one of her paintings were sold for $25000 first art school for elephants was opened at dash in lampang where was the first art school opened the first art school was opened at the thai elephant conservation in lampang right see we did the possessive pronouns isn't it so the words here in red are the possessive pronouns because they show the possessions what what possession the world came to see her paintings whose paintings animals paintings right rubies so we don't use ruby here instead of ruby we will be using her but painting is a noun so we we are using possessive pronoun after the painting isn't it so 
पेंटिंग इज द पसेशन ऑफ रूबी रूबी का अमानत है वो राइट right? पेंटिंग पे रूबी का अधिकार है सो इट इज इट इज हर्स पेंटिंग नाउ सी हियर पेंटिंग ऑफ देर सुन पेंटिंग ऑफ देर बिकेम फेमस हुज पेंटिंग एलिफेंट्स सो एलिफेंट्स हियर इज अ प्लूरल नाउन सो प्लूरल नाउन के साथ वी आर यूजिंग देर फॉर पोजेसिव प्रो नाउन एंड ऑल्सो पेंटिंग इज अ नाउन और प्लूरल प्लूरल नाउन सो देर वी आर यूजिंग आफ्टर द प्लूरल नाउन राइट सो पोजेसिव प्रो नाउन्स फॉर प्लूरल नाउन इज देर Plural noun is elephants and possessive and possessive pronoun is theirs because it's a plural. Many elephant, right? So it becomes elephants, isn't it? Okay. Now, what else we can do from here is we can find out the. what we can find out we can find out the opposites of the words right like come opposite of come is go fine um opposite of red can be green because red is for stop and green is for grow go right so this way we can do many things and we came to know about this intelligent elephant named ruby